everyone uh, today I wanted to show you um, two of my hairstyles that I do because people ask me what do I do with my hair um, when it starts getting problematic when it's not where you've just put you know where you've just washed it and put stuff in it because if you've got curly hair out there I feel your pain um, if you know you'll know like if it's curly hair like my hair which is hectic curly then you know that it's it's quite difficult to um, do any hairstyles and stuff like that with it um, unless you really um, like have had years of experience of playing around and trying to just get it to work so I'm going to show you two hairstyles that I do um, when um, my hair is on the okay side like now where um, I've just washed it because as you know it's curly hair you can't wash your hair every day because then your hair will become like grass and it will start breaking off you won't have anything left and um, you have to wash it only once a week all, hair, all the hairdressers say that to you and then you have a lot of product that you have to put in your hair as well so every now and again you also have to take the product out which um, they call stripping in the hairdresser um, I don't like doing it in the hairdresser though because it's quite hectic on your hair so what I do is I usually just rinse my hair with white vinegar um, and I do it about three times I, I might smell like uh, chips afterwards like um, McDonald's chips but um, it actually works <laughs> so uh, yeah in the past when I was younger I used to also use mayonnaise as a um, hair treatment which works one well it worked wonders I haven't done it in years now but um, so you you rinse your hair with with vinegar and then you put mayonnaise in it I started smelling like a like a salad so um, it was quite entertaining <laughs> so but anyway so today I'm gonna do two of my um, very simple quick quick hairstyles that I do that helps me when um, when I don't want to uh, do too much to my hair because it's still at its okay stage the only thing with my hair is we my daughter and I thinned it out the other day and we thinned it out too much so now it doesn't have that weight to pull the curls nicely and to make them softer and I'm having a problem with it like sticking like a straw roof at the moment but I'm just trying to work with it <laughs> see what I can do but anyway so I'm just gonna start and I'm gonna take these out and I'll show you okay so the first one is quite simple uh, I got this at I think it was Discam, so it looks like this. So you can either leave it as a wide one, or you can scrunch it up. So let's do this. So if you leave it as the wide one, you go for the almost like a gypsy type look. Which is this one. Now if your hair is not as curly as mine, you can always pull out pieces here to go down the side and the front, which will also look very nice. But mine I leave all back because otherwise my hair is very curly and um, it just gets in my way. <laughs> so I like to leave it all back like this. Okay. Now the other one that I do that's also very simple um, just because of the fact that I can't always leave it like this because I'm not one of those people that enjoy the afro look um, I know that there are people that's got my type of hair that like to have the big hair afro look I'm not like that um, I like my hair to be flatter <laughs> which I know with curly hair is impossible almost but yeah sometimes I have a feeling where I want to have it like out there but not very often so I'm going to use this clip upside down, little butterfly one so like that and I'm going to take my hair like this okay and just make sure before you clip it in that you happy with what it looks like over here on the side and then I just clip it into the back so make sure it's all nice. I'm 
try and turn around and show you what it looks like. So that is my two simple hairstyles. As you can see, it's very quick and easy and um, I didn't have to put too much effort into it. I will also be doing a video with um, my weird hairstyles that I do when my hair starts getting to that point where you can't just leave it down anymore. And instead of just always putting it up in a ponytail, um, I've found other um, alternatives. <laughs> so I'll show you that in a different video. So I hope that you enjoyed the video and if you did, can you please give it a thumbs up? I would appreciate it. And if you haven't subscribed already, if you could please, if you could please do so. If you click the bell notification, you'll be informed when I upload a video again. And also um, all my social media will be in the description block below. So you can go and have a look there. So I hope that you have a lovely day further and keep your crystal on and your sparkle strong. Goodbye.